Hey guys, welcome to Get Out. And if you've been wondering about what backpack to get for your new backpacking adventure, or if you're just new to backpacking, let me give you a great idea right here. If you enjoy the outdoors as much as I do, please subscribe today and hit the bell. That way you're notified every time I put up a new video every weekend. Today, today I'm going to go over why I like the Scout 3400 Teton Backpacking Backpack. Okay, you've got uh, padded shoulder straps here that give you a lot of comfort while you're wearing this on your back. Um, whether you've got 30, 20, 40 pounds in it, it's great. This is what I really love. You can adjust uh, where this pad hits your waist compared to where it hits your shoulders because you can take this out and adjust it. I'm a pretty short guy and so I needed something that would be built for a guy of my size. This pack will support anybody, man, woman, or child between five feet and six four. And on the straps themselves, of course, you got straps to adjust your gear load when you have it on your back, whether you want to lean back a little bit or pull closer to you. Places to hang uh, different gear from right here. And an adjustable chest strap. The waist belt is padded right here and also all the way around the sides. And of course, you've got adjustments here on it. And of course, an adjustable belt with a nice, big, easy to use clip. Also on the back side of the pack, you'll notice these straps here that you could actually put your poles down through on both sides. If you'd like to pack your poles or an ice ax, something like that. And the Scout 3400 is about a 55 liter pack. And I will show you all of the compartments that you have in this awesome pack. I decided to bring quite a bit of stuff with me today just to show you how much you can actually fit in all these pouches here. So today, just on this outside flap right now, I've got my rain gear. And if I undo the top here, it reveals a cinch bag style top, which inside here, I've got my fuel canister right now just some of my camera gear tripod and my big camera bag and I also have a nice little hiking chair that I can use if I need something to sit on so inside here you've got a nice pouch where you can put your hydration pack and that will run through right here on the inside of the flap you've got a great pocket you can keep snacks toilet paper anything you need to in here it's a good size flap um, and of course keeps everything dry and out of the weather there. You can see it offers bungees up top here so you could carry um, anything you need to up here and keep it strapped down, keep it to you. And then on the back side, you've got another pouch. So you can carry lots more items. I've got hammock straps in here. You could keep some mountain houses or any type of your food zipped away in here and weatherproofed. It has nice, large side pouches. It's like this one. I've got my hammock and a few other items. And that, of course, is offered on both sides. Extra food, first aid kit, flashlights, anything you need, you can put in these nice, big side pouches. And on the front, you can see there is more bungees. So, of course, you can hang things from those, store stuff behind it like my machete here and 
Uh, just lots of options for carrying things if you don't want it inside the pack. And one of my favorite parts is this bottom pouch. It unzips. I've got my pillow in here, my sleeping pad, and my sleeping bag. And it's a zippered pouch that keeps that separated from the rest of the pack. So if you would like to utilize that for more space, simply unzip it. And then you've got room all through the rest of your pack. I personally like to keep that zipped up. That way I can get my sleeping pad and sleeping bag and all that out without having to mess up everything else in the pack and just keep everything else where it needs to be. This also offers a rain cover and it is built right into this Velcro pouch under here. You also have elastic mesh pockets on both sides of the bottom. You can carry water bottles or flashlights and anything you need in there as well. And then of course, for your tent, sleeping pad or anything like that, you've got the clips right back here to hold that up and keep it with you as you go. And so I have found this to be a very great backpack. It's a fully framed backpack and you can carry everything you need. It only weighs 4.5 pounds, empty. And of course, whenever you're hiking, with all the weight distributing components of this pack, it makes backpacking very, very easy. And as part of the Amazon affiliate program, if you do decide you would like to get one of these backpacks, I do have a link in the description below. And if you decide to purchase one, of course, I would see just a small bit of commission if you did so. So thank you for watching, guys. To see this pack in action, Click right down here for our Giant City 12 mile hike in the rain or right over here for our 92 degree night hike at the Pyramid State Park. See you next time guys. If you haven't already, please subscribe to the channel right up here.